Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Cash Money Gabs taking over for the 99 and the 2000s and cashmoney.gabs on Instagram. If you haven't already, please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Here on my channel, I do cash stuffing videos, budget with me's, and all of the things money and budgeting related. For today's video, we are doing a cash stuffing of my boyfriend's paycheck. This is our first paycheck for the month of April. And for him, it's actually a three paycheck month. So total, we'll be getting five paychecks this month. So we'll see what we can do, um, how much money we can save, and what I can do to pay off my, um, my loans and stuff. And then also, if you haven't noticed, I did get my nails done. So let's do a little nail cam. I know that they had the crib going crazy down bad when they had it in the last damn bag. Yeah. Where did these niggas be at when they said it? You guys, I am like obsessed with these nails. I showed my nail girl a picture and she just she just went off it is giving it is giving material girl okay you can't tell me nothing with these nails right now like don't don't talk to me talk talk to the bears talk to these are bears guys they're upside down but don't talk to me talk to the bears they are so cute my nail girl she's she's young well she's younger than me she's 19 19 or 20 so when we were done she was like oh my god like those are so old school like very like oldies old school you know like 90s 2000s and i was like oh old school like are you calling me old like this isn't old like 2000s was was only you know 22 years ago what do you what do you mean i am obsessed with these so that's what we are working with click clack i already have the money set up and we are cash stuffing 837 dollars i didn't do a budget with me because one my nails looked ratchet um a few days ago before i got my nails done and um i had some things that i had to pay so this is what's left over for us to do the cash stuffing we will start with my cash envelopes to see what we have oops wrong way you guys i have the most exciting news um i found out about this like a few weeks ago but it's just gonna be an effect like this weekend my boyfriend as i said he did start a new job about a month ago now he is already getting a six dollar raise at first it was four dollars and then i don't know what he did or what they were talking about but he like told me this morning like no it's gonna be like it's gonna be six dollars and i was like what the hell like how <laughs> we're like really excited he's super excited so i guess it was all worth it you know struggling for him to find a job and things like that so i can't wait to see how that's gonna look i am mad at it i'm not i'm not questioning it so we're just gonna leave it at that but anyway groceries we have 21 dollars left over and guys, my job ordered a lot everybody in my company um hello fresh meals so we have like dinner for two nights i'm still gonna put a hundred dollars but i don't think we'll need like a lot this week for groceries so it's still gonna get 100 gas is getting its usual 40. my boyfriend had to drive extra this week to go to like his training and stuff he had to do so we did he did put more like more money into gas i think he put like 60 dollars instead of 40 but yeah that was just he put extra miscellaneous we have seven dollars left over i think i bought an icy and a churro from sam's club because it's only like two dollars miscellaneous is just gonna get its usual 10 eat out is gonna get 40 tomorrow well if it's april 2nd then my boyfriend's birthday we are we are going out so we're gonna be eating out this weekend we're gonna be doing a lot of things mostly just eating so receipts make sure to use my code thank you everybody that has used my code so far i've already redeemed a 25 dollars gift card for chipotle so that's another thing we're gonna be eating for dinner this week so shout out to you all and if you have not signed up with my code make sure to do so i will put my code here 
here you go so yeah that is it for my wallet and of course i never changed this thing today is actually april 1st so april fool's day my grandma tried to play a prank on me but it didn't work i'm gonna play a prank on her later tonight so we'll see how that goes okay next are my coins i have more coins this week more than usual they're like stuck come on okay Next is going to be savings challenges and I'm kind of excited about this because we're going to count our $1 savings challenge and see what we do with it. But first, I want to do my weight loss challenge. So you guys, I am so excited. I am under 170 finally. Um, it seems like it took forever. So I am 168. I lost two pounds this week. So for every one pound I lose, I put in a dollar. We're going to take two dollars from rollover and put it in the weight loss challenge. It now has... 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 26, 27. And I'm just gonna keep doing this until I reach my goal weight. So if that takes me like a year, I'm just gonna keep doing this challenge for till I get there, if, even if it takes like a year or whatever. Going back to the dollar savings challenge, let's take her out. The only thing about this bear on my nail, I noticed this when I was trying to get out money from my wallet, is it gets stuck in the envelope. So I didn't really think that through, but it's okay. We have one more dollar from my cash envelopes and then two dollars from, from the paycheck. So let's count it. Seventy six, and yes, we did end with the raggedy ass dollar that's going back to the bank. Seventy six dollars in the first three months. Let me write that down because I will forget. Seventy six, and put that to the side. That is it for the dollar savings challenge, and then we'll start up again next week. Now we are gonna finish up Chris Budget's birthday challenge. Her birthday was just this past week. We need to put $10. I have a 20, so let's break it. We are coloring the candle, which is included in the challenge, and then the last layer of the cake. If I did do this right, we should have $50, so let's count it. So, let's pull her out. We have 10, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, $50. So we'll put that to the side and see what we do with it. Oh, wait, that 10 was supposed to be here. So we have $15 left over in rollover from cash envelopes. So let's finish the mystery savings challenge this is from the bell's budget and we need to scratch off one more can you guys see what is it oh it's a five. Oh, thank god okay okay perfect so i have a five dollar bill that's gonna complete the mystery savings challenge so let's count and see who is right i think i guess like a hundred or maybe 120 we'll see 20 40 50 60 70 80 85 90 95 a hundred i love this challenge this is so much fun i want to get another one now okay so that is it for um all of the savings challenges that i was doing so we did complete those now let me put this to the side because i need some room for this this was kind of like my idea but also my boyfriend's idea um i had this kind of in the back we made a cute little easter basket we got this from dollar tree and look at these cute little eggs they're sparkly and they're pink so i had to get them they're like two dollars from walmart i got this it's like candy my boyfriend wanted it so he'll eat this like at the end of the month he put the random numbers in here so he kind of like made everything and yeah that's what we are going to be stuffing all the way to the end of the week so there's one two three four five six i think we're gonna do two today i'm scared because i told him not to put big numbers so 
the first one. Oh, he put eight dollars. Oh, that's cute. He's a big um Lakers fan, so number eight. He put Mamba and Mamba Sita forever. He's a um he's a big Kobe Bryant fan. Let's see what the next one is. Let's do this one. Okay. Fifty. What? Fifty? Fifty and why did he write that? Fifty and zero cents. Why? I told him. Oh, okay, I guess it's coming from his paycheck so okay should we do another one no i don't want to do another one <laughs> okay so we have 50 i can't believe he put 50 like now i don't even want to do it because i'm scared he put like 150 or something in here i'm gonna break a five no i'm gonna do a 10 because i think i need one 50 he put 50 and then eight so five six seven eight wow okay so that was fun i literally did not know what he was gonna put like obviously why would i why would i want him to put 50 since it's a new challenge we'll put it in this envelope so 58 so that's it for the savings challenge binder that was stressful next is the 100 envelope challenge i'm so glad i picked this beforehand otherwise this would have been a shit show imagine i picked a hundred or something another 50 jesus so i picked 14 and 40 we have 40 and then 14 10 11 12 13 14 That is it for the 100 envelope box. I still have a 10 left over from my rollovers, so I'll just put it back in here. For the rest of the money, I did not plan it out. I only budgeted out my um, cash envelopes, and there is one bill that I am cash stuffing, so let's do that. Everything is pretty much empty because it's the first of the month, and you know what that means. This is for my car payment. Um, it is getting 65, so 50. Let's put down two 50s and pick up 165. I hope I did that right. Let me know if I didn't. So now it has 100, 200, 210, 220, 230, 240, 250, 260. Okay, and then I've been saying that I need to figure out like subscriptions. So I'm gonna let's put 24 subscriptions that way I can actually like budget it out and not um, confuse myself. So moving on to the pink binder emergency. Let's put 30. So I'm gonna put down a 20 and then pick up a 50. So now it has 2,250. Okay, then car maintenance. So I have my little tracker. This is from the Bell's budget. Let's do two cars. That's gonna equal $40. So two 20s. So car maintenance has 100, 20, 140, 160, 180, 220. Debt is going to be getting, okay, we'll put the ones and then 100. So for debt, it's going to be getting 100 and then I'll just throw in the $3 because it's sitting there and I don't want it to sit there anymore. And then for furniture, that's just going to get a 5. So now it has 10, 20, 30, 35, 36, 37, 38. I think we did spend money. My boyfriend needed to get something for to make cookies. It's it's like a mixer, but it's like a cheap mixer. It was only like $20. So he likes baking a lot. So we got that. So that's it for the pink binder. Okay. And then moving on to the spooky binder. So Sam's Club isn't going to get anything because we're going to come back to it. Health is going to get a 10 so it now has 15 medicals nothing black friday will get a five so it now has 20 30 40 45 holidays will also get a five 
but now it has 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, and then Christmas, guess what? Let's also put a five into Christmas. So that will also have 45, 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45. I'm really not rushing to stuff Christmas because I don't really have a lot of people to buy for now so love that for me and then my boyfriend's birthday is i guess when you see this um it's gonna be today so he has for his birthday 20 40 60 70 75 80 85 let's just put a five to make it 90 keep it cute and then that is it for the spooky binder and then last it's gonna be the low priority binder so date night let's put a 10 so it now has 35 my envelope won't get anything because I'm getting my eyebrows retouched up so this is 25 I'm gonna 20 25 so I'm gonna put down a 50 Um, my nails, that will get 30. This is gonna be for next month? No, the end of this month. Beauty. I like ran out of my eye cream and I didn't even notice, so, and it's like $30. Let's put 30. Um, my tattoo. Okay, so for family fun, we are gonna see my family, well, my nephew and his dad we are gonna see them this sunday i don't think we're doing anything though so i don't think i have to spend money but um we'll just put 10 so 20 30 40. we usually like to take them to like um like those fun plexes where they have go-karts and all this crazy stuff but um i think this weekend we're just gonna chill then for my boyfriend's tattoo he's gonna get a 50 so that's 50 70, 90, 110, 130, 140. And then little Bella is going to get 15. Heck stuff that will get um, 20. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 45. I mentioned before I need a new Alexa. And echo show i want a new one really bad because mine is breaking for vacation what do we do what do we do i want to put a 20 so let me condense this let me put down two 20s and then two fives pick up the 50 put for travel a 20 we will color in a heart airplane oh i didn't even count it hello so 50 70 90 110 115 oh my gosh we actually made a hundred dollars i started stuffing this like last year in august and so that's exciting though um so we have 20 30 40 dollars left over so i don't know what to do let's put another 20 to date night because we want to see the batman movie soon so 20 30 40 50 55 okay cool what do we do I'm going to put $10 for my tumblers. So it has 15 now. There's not any new tumblers or like that I know of that are coming out, but we'll just, I'm going to put these two fives to the side because I really don't know where I'm going to put $10. Okay, so bringing back out the money from my savings challenges, I'm just going to put these fives together with this. So we know that this is 76. So let me get out my calculator and this is from the mystery savings challenge and then Chris Budget's birthday challenge. So 76 from the $1 savings challenge and then here we have 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. So 76 plus 160, so $236 from these savings challenges. I could have like a whole nother cash stuffing like right now, but I'm not going to do that because I did have a plan of what I wanted to do with this money. So, so we're going to take this out. I have my debt envelope and that's going to get $50, 20, 50, 
So it now has $153. And then this is my household envelope because I don't have one like my own yet. So this is going to get, so I'm going to put $100 into household. That way it has like a good amount and then every week or whenever I stuff it, I don't have to put like such big amounts. Um, someone commented that that's what they did. They put like a hundred bucks and then every week they just put like five or ten dollars. And then if we ever need anything, we'll just grab it from here. So this obviously needs to be condensed, but we'll do that for another video. Okay, then we have seven, so we have the 76 still, and then um, 10, so 86. So I'm bringing back out this binder because this is actually going into my Sam's Club envelope because we need to make a trip to Sam's Club to get toilet paper and snacks and just to re-up on everything. I want to start doing that like every couple of months so same idea with like household i'm just gonna pick put a big stack to jump ahead and then it'll be easier to save up for next so this is 86 don't judge me i'm gonna get out a calculator and then this is 40 50 55 so 86 plus 55 so 141 so 141 dollars for sam's club um i think i want to get to like 200 or 250 before we go i don't know we'll see okay so i didn't think this through how am i gonna put this in here do you guys see that what am i gonna do i really didn't think about this so i'm gonna leave it empty in the binder for now the only place that it will fit is gonna be in here this will be my sam's club jar for right now oh look at that okay oh wow that looks nice look at that that's very satisfying okay okay so that is it for my video we did a lot of things we finished some challenges we did the cash stuffing thank you guys so much for sticking with me to the end of this video make sure to like comment and subscribe and turn on your post notification bell that way you all never miss another one of my videos i will talk to you all later bye now